Today, Ismail and I are sitting in the Microsoft Pakistan office. And we are talking to Mr. Shweb Khalil, the marketing lead of Microsoft Pakistan. Over to you, Ismail. Thanks, Sriji. Sir, how does it feel to be working for Microsoft Pakistan? Oh, actually, it feels uh, great, a little bit stressful, and also uh, it's it feels to be fun. Um, it's actually a combination of both. So there are times when you feel uh, there's a lot of work to do. There are times when you enjoy a lot. So it's uh, it's it's generally it's a uh, there's not one feeling I can attribute to it. There are there are multiple feelings, <laughs> which goes with working for Microsoft. How do you think technology is helping kids these days? I think first of all, technology is um, not just helping kids; it's helping everyone, and especially f for kids, uh, in terms of uh, access to knowledge, technology has greatly improved the odds for people who are uh, now going to school compared to if you're going to school 10 years ago when I was going to school when uh, there was just one computer in the whole school and now you have access to internet now you have access to knowledge at the same time technology has opened up new venues for you guys in terms of when we were growing up uh, being a programmer or being a billionaire by developing a, something like Facebook was not an option but now you have so many options and all thanks to different technologies as a child if I want to develop uh, software for your devices, for your computers, what opportunities do I have? What resources do I have? And how is Microsoft helping me to achieve that goal? Okay. Okay. First of all, you have to uh, you have to think in terms of when you develop an app. It's not just for today. I, the app is going to be there. How is the market going to be in two to three years from now? So, if you see today, Apple is a dominant platform, followed by Android, and then there are others like BlackBerry and others. But would the market be same three years from now? I think with all the developments with Windows 8 coming up, with Nokia's partnership with Microsoft, market is going to evolve. And Microsoft is going to be one of the key players. So you want to make an application not just for today, but for something which is going to be relevant three years from now, four years from now. So keep that in mind. And the other thing is, uh, we have a team of experts sitting in Microsoft Office. I don't think so. Um, any of our competitors offer that where you can interact face to face with our team. They're based in Karachi, they're based in Islamabad, and they will help you uh, develop apps they will guide you in terms of how do you make a successful app or how do you upload it on the marketplace and how do you not have to pay the the, the, the fee for that so where do you see the future of Microsoft in Pakistan okay I think being a Pakistani I would really really want to see Microsoft's presence go in Pakistan not just for Microsoft's sake but for Pakistan's sake because more we grow more job opportunities we create bigger ecosystem we have I would really like to see and I hope uh, that Microsoft is going to grow in Pakistan and at the same time Microsoft will be able to uh, recruit many of young Pakistanis and Microsoft is going to be able to create a lot of jobs here through its technology through its programs and through its uh, offices here so sir have you got any message for the kids who are participating in the ISU for one thing I've realized being in technology industry and being working for Microsoft or being working for a company like Microsoft that sky is the limit do not limit yourself in 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 any way in terms of that uh, I live in a third world country or I live in or I did not go to the best university it's uh, it's all within you so uh, try and live up to your potential thank you sir it was really nice to meet you pleasure <laughs> <laughs> okay so sure.